problème, on a goûté de nous. Mais dans l'Imran Silla, from the Strategic Communications Unit, dans le Ministry of Information and Communications. A chance, Fambou le Wede, dans le host, we will be done to look forward to His Excellency the President, Kitabi Ria Judas Madabio, he addressed to the nation. Don't get the opportunity a few moments ago for your written first gentleman of the Republic of Sierra Leone and commander in chief of the armed forces, get for tell we Sierra Leoneans. I did also this evening with the press secretary, when I be former presidential spokesperson also for His Excellency the President, Retired Brigadier Julius Madabio, and the Minister of Information and Communications, Mohamed Rahman Suare, for local Sidon, and dissect, love scatter, within the power, don't tell we all. I will ask the two individuals, the two gentlemen, them, for tell Fambule Aoudou. I will start with uh, with press secretary. Well, family, we are doing our day now. We will watch we this evening after President don't talk. Um, we hope say everybody did well, um, and we're glad if we can put more on the um, waiting. This excellency, the President don't say to the nation and make we discuss some of the issues that we the President don't talk about. I will also extend the same uh, opportunity to the Minister of Information for Tell Family Day. Family Day, we are good evening. I think the good for the Naya for Rob Motpa putting the pad on top so that all men understand the key issues. I tell you, plenty thank you. Family on I'll do again. I will start with the Minister of Information and Communications, Mohamed Amantuari. We don't see the past few days which it don't look like for every single Sahel Union, particularly for the parts that were affected. His Excellency the President don't make very clear and make very categorical statements as to within get what happened going forward, but then also for restore calm and give people their hope and give them some sense of stability. Well, so, um, His Excellency, in speech to all, all just hear who will listen very clear. And who will this alone here, Sabisi, um, in the run up to this, but people them know the threats in this country um, by various means. We don't hear social media threats there um, over the period. More recently, they don't intensify that one day, they don't increase that threat today. They don't say then they can't take over state house, then they can't take over parliament building, more than can, then they disrupt the city. And we, after two days of sit down, right, went to the encounter this town and then caused mayhem. Then terrorists, then, then insurrection people, then insurrectionists, then then Canada, then bond property, then government property, then 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 literally caused a lot of problems in this country. Then key policeman there, then bond police station there, then bond government property there. And then literally grind the city to a halt. This is not terrorism. Not the perfect definition of terrorism. Terrorism, a terrorist, that's what they seek for coerce, for force people there, for do things they don't want to do, for achieve a political objective, right? Literally using force and all that. So now the, these are domestic terrorists. Eh? For probably we need for pre modifiers more, right? Now domestic terrorists than this. So. Then Canada, they cause all lens in there, they do the bad bats in there, they, 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 you know, they make the streets here. Already we know say this country will be known to make a lot of progress. This country um, will be known to experience an 11 year old civil war. We don't transition, we don't come up on our now. We don't become a, a, a we don't stabilize the country. We don't the transition to peace consolidation. Yeah, we don't they make that peace, we don't, don't get consolidated. consolidate. This is the 20 years, so, right? So today, Salon are the fourth most peaceful country in the whole of Africa and the most peaceful at the Manor River Union. So this thing where the terrorists and then domestic terrorists and do then this year, it don't it want for undermine all the ingredients that the president don't make. Now the last stop also first. I'll uh, tell you tell plenty thank you, uh, Mr. Minister. Uh, I will come out to repress secretary. 
before the incident that happened starting Monday, and we yeah. then they talk about cost of living and we in the field say not been a cover because we know now say eventually we will see unfold. You not get nothing for do down there because you not go take seven eight years of age you pull them a treat you give people a cutlass and axe and hoe and shovel for go make a case against cost of living but his excellency the president in his speeches now in address to the nation don't talk tranga tranga one and he also don't tell sierra leoneans they say the law it for don't pay anybody where they catch and where they find culpable it will for don't pay them like a stone. How you see that part of the president's speech in terms of assuring the vast majority of Sierra Leoneans will ordinarily very peaceful and won't forget the opportunity for about their normal business? Well, I think um, this evening uh, you see say not to just your president talk. You see say na commander in chief of the armed force of the Republic of Sierra in talk. Because the system they talk, and they talk with the authority and power. But above all, and they tell you, say, this is not somebody where he also feel very sad. Because when you turn president, you they take an oath for protect the people and life body as a responsibility. And then when you get insurgents, People away create men in directions like where ministers say they use picky them for going to street a whole placard for create men and problems will lead to the death of innocent people alive. You see, we don't see videos there, we don't see image them of police people and people away in service, people away only go serve in line of duty. When they kill, then kill them in the most dreadful manner, brutal manner. A manner where you can imagine, say, na salon man, they kill him, in salon man so. So you know, say, we are at an extraordinary times. And therefore, these are times they wait for call for serious action. And you see from the tone of the president, from the language of the president, and they tell you, say, this na something where we know tolerate, and as something where people are where they support, people are where they incite, the one where they collaborate, the full force of law will go after them. And the reason why we have to do that is because Sierra Leone is a country where it's not a peaceful country. We don't have relatively peace before all the tears start. We don't say we have the first peaceful country in the region. We tell you, say, we all. So people, they say there are issues with peace and reconciliation. They snow. We can't be peaceful. But you still get people who just feel, say, for me, they achieve their own political gains, their own political aim. Then for create malicious conduct. Then for threatening the legitimate government of the day, for overthrow the government. Where essentially we get audios them, we get videos them. People are winning a diaspora. They the sponsor people away in this country, mm -hmm. and you also get people in back where they within this country back, where they collapse with them people and they incite people in back, where don't lead to Usa Ude. So they speak generally, not just for reassure people and tell them, say, indeed, the commander in chief of the Republic of Salim Armed Forces, you know, the president, where Nayambi take and subscribe to that oath for protect the lives and property of every Sierra Leonean. Go and show say anybody, anybody will be involved in their acts there. The Lord will go after them and will go make sure say justice will be done. And the quoting president say justice gets to be done for them people who will kill. I mean imagine police officer left in Osnabri for the work. For go serve in the line of duty, you get people who are insurrectionists, we're going to street for cosmic and chaos. The only job we enough for do, I'm going to take property. Mm -hmm. These same people turn against those people, and most of them kill them very brutally in the most dreadful way. 
On imagine a way. Then save me justice. And you know, this is a moment where I also think, say, why is the one in death for full account we commit those offenses them back? We take a huge responsibility. Mm. Huge responsibility. Political leadership in political parties because most of you use them when they come well lead to this. These are people who don't identify themselves and they belong to the political opposition party. Absolutely. Because even the interim chairman of the APC, when they interview on a S and a BBC, when they talk, even admit that some people within the party are collaborators of people them who go for create them name and they are for clear. Mm -hmm. So they safe for make sure they denounce them people and they absolutely this actually safe from them people and they because at the end of the day we all get responsibility mm -hmm. for keeping peace and unity of this country. I, I tell you plenty, thank you, Press Secretary. You know, uh, in addition to some of the things that you don't say before, I go to the Minister of Information again. Sir so the multi party politics or democracy as we call them in 1996. So from 1996 to 2002 to 2007 to 24 to 2018, every government we don't power, citizens of the Republic of Sierra Leone, now that they vote that government and the president they into office. And the constitution made clear positions that until another election, that president they and that government they for remain in place for oversee the affairs of the state. I think it's important for Lefa Mule no say that one day not get for change. The President of the Republic of Sierra Leone, the responsibility, amongst many other responsibilities, for make sure say we democracy remain as we go into the next elections. In fact, now for the reasons then they make, they don't try for pass plenty laws now for make sure say uh, some 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 assurance day when it comes to election. Nobody not get for Sudan and the fixed election dates now. Now we know clearly they say now June 24, next year 2023, then are the next presidential and parliamentary elections. On the two way you touch on about the innocent people and police officers that we don't lost their life. One particular one day, I think now be about the first one we lost in life now the eastern part of it all. Now been pastor. He didn't live now to Azak farm. I get a friend who's very close to him. Now he tell me say he said the only two way that man me they do that did it. He said they try to pacify the crowd. You know, the pastorship in arm, the Christian nature in arm, give them that sort of uh, aura and ability there for begin to talk to them. But the crowd not see and that way they, because they be don't instigate them, they be don't fund them, right? They be don't brainwash them for carry out some of them dastardly acts. We see in His Excellency the President in speech, he talk about the effort with his government don't make since April of 2018 for deal with the economy, for make sure they pay salaries, for make sure they still able for embark on human capital development, people's education, on healthcare, and plenty of other things there. Mr. Minister, when President, they make all of them points and day as to what in government don't do. What do you make of them, number one? Number two, how many more we don't do for me to say, even amidst the global challenges as President say, we don't do for do all of them today for help for cushion the effect and impact. We will also see then this year the petrol price that don't come on back again by 1,000, I think now, 18 million. Now we don't get that. Okay, so the case where His Excellency they make now this broadcast. Uh, because some people then they make arguments say, oh, now for the difficult economic circumstances, then do demonstrations. So the argument, the counter argument there is, you know, the camp uh, peaceful possession with a gun, self loading guns, hmm? automatic rifles, pistols, machetes, hoes, all kind of weapon you bring out to a peaceful possession. So the president want to make the point see, this was an insurrection. This is not ter domestic terrorism, right? Because if we talk about economic circumstances, you never forget to say, why is the whole world day in this near recession? Now, during this period here, so, 
this government launched a free quality education with the with 22 percent of the national budget day under the same scheme here so um would they do school feeding now about 12 districts now by next year would expand that but on the would we'll get subsidized school buses across this country with the bond shop me with the bond me I don't want this see school bus. I'm a villager grew up, so I may not see school bus. <laughs> but fact is, in your own lifetime, President Bill, they don't bring school buses there. And sadly enough, then domestic terrorists, they had them. Pull some of them buses there. With glee, they, they really, they snap. And for let them see them on camera. If that is not domestic, domestic terrorism, you get for telling me what it is. So they do that in a day. Now, during the same period that they talk about, what they say, economic challenges. Now, here we see, in other countries, they put the two line for even rest. Basic essential commodities around the world who they see an author and a social media. Now, yeah, as this COVID begin, His Excellency be very, you know, a look ahead because they are ahead of in times. And so, look, would they, would they enter challenging periods? Law put in place a quick action economic recovery program. Under that program, the, um, the central bank opened a 50 million direct credit line for importers that they able to bring goods they in. Mm -hmm. Right, so it's in the rest, like oil, all the basic essentials in there. For other countries, they may to live for so we get enough and to spare now because the president mentions and seriously, right? And we'll make sure, say again, after that, right? We'll make sure, say, during the lockdown, they will be the do, then half of lockdown. You know, the president a care about the people there, but they put the people at half a center of everything, they're aware of the kind of economy we will inherit and the challenges. So, why is other countries in the lockdown? For two weeks, three weeks or so, the president locked down for then three days and so. But in then three days, then people they only live with disability. But they get a direct cash transfers, money for look after themselves because a whole lot of compatriots there, if they're not can drag, they're not get something. So open now opportunity day. Right? Apart from now on day. During that same time, to NAXA, we do direct cash transfers to money. Right? Just for we we'll keep the place there, okay. Let all man able to get along with in life. Yeah? Apart from now and in addition, we also made sure say we commission the Munafa fund in that same period. Yeah. And also about five million people are not benefit from Munafa going across this country. They are quite grateful. They just they add ask his excellency, do your Adam. And I got good news for them people The president uh, very recently the SMEDA, small media enterprises development agency don't go around the country for education. So I'm sure any time before the end of the month or so, they will begin the next stretch. This is progress. This is a government that honestly, truly, and sincerely cares. Nobody now can say that for economic challenges. Yes, the whole world gets economic challenges. But this was a government which don't fall in hand and do nothing. Mm -hmm. We do a lot of things. Yes, we recognize there are still challenges, but you, you see, would they take the hard, would they, would they really address them? Yeah? The level of the president talk about skills development. A whole lot of young people then challenge, they don't get skills there. Again, we had a 20, we had an 11 year old civil war. A whole lot of young people that miss out on schooling. Picking their loss in their childhood. They're not able to learn skills and trade. This government guy said, this is serious. Law provide an opportunity for letting people here get skills. So we have a 50 million, 50 million dollars set aside. We don't set up tech vocal and literally only districts there. For let people they're able to go there and learn trade. We learn trade, you know the way for 30 days. Someday, you know, inside the, inside the setup of your own business, right? I remember that one meeting where I recently did with the World Bank. The Chief Minister tell the World Bank um, Regional Operations Manager how they visit. So look, now true so they invest in skills development. But we think so we need to get start of capital for them to put there. So by the time they graduate from skills development, then we begin look at let the, let the setup set up their own practice and begin practice and, and begin become employers rather than looking for employment. So a lot has happened during this period. Yeah, this government care. You heard the president talk about rights, then we don't open up the space. Yeah, mm -hmm. people want to talk about that now. Whatever this is, I can go on for it. Yes, no. I, I, will send, I will send the same question to uh, 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 yes, uh, because plenty of the minister don't talk about where president don't do any government over four years. I see you say, you did, you did look more small, small, like for say, you say get one, two, three, where you are add power with the minister don't say. No, well, you know, People and they say that um, these people are not going to express themselves, space not day for many people and say they want to express them concern or disaffection, but that is not correct. 
that is not correct. I mean, the minister don't do extremely well in terms of press freedom. Okay, we now the country where we don't do so much in terms of press freedom and freedom of expression. You know, 55 years they lie below. It's vicious lie below. Oh, come. After many presidents, they don't promise, promise, promise. That president will say, say no. He said, even though I have been there as opposition leader um, in SNPP, you know, I was so vilified. But yes, he said, the press then gets an important role to the play. And therefore, they are partners in development. And as a result of that, that creates for them the environment, Usai, people are going to write freely and talk freely. So what do we do? Okay? Mm. We abolish the part five of the criminal libel law. Okay? We must stop the death penalty. Yeah. Death penalty. This is an instrument where many governments across the world, especially in Africa, mm. they use for target opposition leaders them. Mm. For use for target opposition politicians them. He done that book for many, many years, the longest time. The president guy said no. He said we for now move forward than this. We are a progressive nation. We could only use this like how they use them in the past way. We possibly do small things in the life and they use um, desperately then go kill them. Say no. We put on a book. We put on a book. So we country we don't make so much progress. Now we don't also pass law for make we make sure say we increase the space for women them in governance. Yeah. A new public elections act where they make for increase woman them, them representation in politics in the governance one out of every three exactly for being woman exactly so we increase the space if a government also don't make sure say we get a forum side civil society organization and government then get a forum and avenue and get a collaboration where well, they engage in the dialogue mm. then they talk mm. For the very first time, we don't internalize and make the talk. To the office of the, or the vice president, make the vice talk. President, yes. Make the talk. So, the space where people they say, the space no day, people don't express themselves. No, the space day. But you get for do them lawfully. Exactly. You get for do them legally, mm -hmm. using the channel. And I make all them opposition politicians, them. We include even the company lawyers, them. When they incite people, them, for protest illegally. They should now take responsibility exactly. of the fatal consequence of what's not happening. Because if the law say you get for make you protest peacefully and within the law, and somebody will incite you and tell you say no, you will not talk so you can do it without the law, then now we're gonna do it illegally and they don't commit crime, fatal consequences, they should take responsibility. They should take responsibility. And now make we feel say we all get responsibility. Whether you are in government, you are in opposition, for what we ensure say we sustain and consolidate with peace and with democracy. And the president talk about that. Now make it make reference to the being humanity. three. Because the being humanity three will come now be opportunity for make we all go all stakeholders, all political parties, religious leaders, everybody. Even in school, picking the self, they all go to the newspaper. For me, we see how we go to get the infrastructure and peace. So don't get the peace commission. And that peace commission day, now it is not supposed to tell you, say, the president is genuine, means well for peace in this country. Exactly. Means well for this country. And now you make, we all as well, if you opposition, Politician, that position, you will also be very responsible in emergencies. So very recently, also again, when Dr. Samuel Kamara, go go talk about, say this government, they employ Kamara, they employ Bangua, just day for employ people they say Bua Bise, it was wrong. That's how they got together one day. Exactly. Because you people now this government or a point, we not mm -hmm. The current chairman of PPRC. Yeah. People and they will not People and they will not appoint. They will not appoint. They will not People and they will not appoint. 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 They will it was a northern African talk for her. Mm -hmm. It don't entrust what they do for the northern African do. 
If person not believe in the northerner, he not believe in the north, he not go appoint somebody for can be in spokesperson when I northerner. We not to mend the person. So all of them tribal bigotry, hate message, and they even at that leadership level. We remember also say um, the mayor of Fitton City Council Akisoya also there was a Ojo we in the talk say you know go employ Kemokaina Fitton City Council. There's no can talk boy. Exactly. All of the things that we the fuel tribal because we need to maintain there yeah. because we also see some people before August eight start. Many people will make audios. Mm -hmm. They were very specific. Yeah. Say so this is a betrayal demonstration. Mm -hmm. Say so because many men are in power, they know they know they know appoint and the people there. They know appoint the people them. This is not because people are at leadership position. They they feel any certain thing in there. And now they go for stop. Now they go for stop. Because if you're not a team man, Sahelon belongs to you. Yeah. If you're not a limba man, Sahelon belongs to you. If you're not a human, Sahelon belongs to you. Sahelon belongs to we all. So we for use opportunity, why is the president's belief say we for restore and maintain an order, but also all the responsible, all the ones that were in sight, that we collaborate, we support this direction. We for also use as an opportunity for people that are Police car passes where the elite at leadership level. For me, also change the utterances, change them conduct, mm -hmm. and denounce most of the things the way I think say don't feel in there. I will tell you plenty, thank you, thank you, and you talk rightly in terms of uh, within Nabi the mindset of His Excellency the President as he been the address the nation this net for let me hear you. I mean exactly what you get for say. I just want to add one or two things before we the round up, since this is a short discussion no more. Then this year, I go my friend, me not to Mende by any means, but also grateful to the Mende people who give me family, my great grandparents, their home, now my bad district in Yawina. So, Daniel, I can't continue for telling, thank you, becoming a Madingo by tribe. So me and this my friend they talk when I'm in the night they tell me say they say in the worry for next year. I say we can do. They say with all of the statements that we the hear from Samuel Kamara, from Ivana Kisoya, he said and even the other one that will come now, if they don't talk about tribe directly, then we begin to talk about region. The one that they appoint as also region number than they come up from. He said next election, June 24, 2023, he said I'm not going only the worry for votes. I go the worry also we think will be the outcome of that vote today. He said, because me don't already be vilified by certain sections of the political group. And if, what, if that outcome they favorable to them, how me go they? How me go turn us alone? So, don't they, they show you see, some of their statements that they would then they express? You know, good for national peace and cohesion. You know, good for the stability of this country. You know, good for peaceful coexistence with ordinarily as a union state. Mendema, the married Timini, Loko, the married Limbafula, the married Madinga, and we are good, but for political reasons, some man they use Skype and region for divide me more than they wrong. Second, Minister of Information, don't talk plenty to your president do. One or two other one they no more go up but small as we round up this discussion. You know, in the midst of all the challenges there, His Excellency the President don't accept five percent increase right on the salaries of lecturers progressively over the years it just don't don't do the same for doctors and the one they're not the health sector you also don't do the same for teachers then we don't add no recruitment for police we don't add also for the civil service and plenty other areas then all of that is possible because the president get cumbra hats as we the round up now mr minister I want to let you capture the mood and the spirit of President here at least to the nation. And within, because President don't talk, he don't address the nation. In words then clear, we don't understand that. But we also want to let family know the mood and the spirit of President Julius Madapio as he be at the nation and talk to the people in this net. Well, you can see the way the power posture 
um, you see her as somebody way angry. A vex, but you know the manifester. You see her as somebody who did the terrorist attacks of the last few days very seriously. Because as Commander-in-Chief of the Armed Forces of the Republic of Sierra Leone, Fountain of Honor and Justice, President of the Republic, now in constitutional obligation for make sure say, they protect the life and property of all Sierra Leoneans. So this is what has come under attack. Like a talk, democracy is under attack, fundamental freedoms and rights are under attack. So you find out, say, a really, really serious about her, um, a posture very good, you know, talk, 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 a talk, talk out with peace one thing after the, the other layer after layer right so this is the thing but we don't see say over the period they use violence as a tool as a weapon for electoral advantage in 2007 for example former president kuruma by then candidate ebk and the bbc interview is say if you don't win that election you will make the country ungovernable so threats and threats of violence have always been used. So 2018, 2018, um, the former flag bearer of the APC, the petitive APC flag bearer, mm -hmm. presumed. Mm -hmm. Yeah, instead say if you don't win that election, because all kinds of problems. Now an APC pattern now. Yes, okay. it's a pattern. You see, recently, well, I mean, um, the um, um, the leader of the opposition parliament i think in london or us ago at a big session apt session the video they all over mm -hmm. the place one of the people then grab when did they get rid of this president now mm. you remember that mm -hmm. yes so this is a systematic you know mm. pattern for use violence for get electoral advantage mm -hmm. but this is a democracy i mean he has been fair enough they don't announce election dates one year advance right nobody not wants to anybody it from from sharing political ideology, from meeting, as long as they organize, they fully process and conform with all the rules there. So, but this is a democracy as commander-in-chief of the armed forces. And don't make a clear say, we will not sit by and see anybody torpedo them gains their own domain. Nadamek, they don't promise a full-scale inquiry into what did not happen. Nadamek, they don't promise, say, them police officers, as soon as they will die, they will fully investigate and make sure say, the law take a fullest course. Yeah. On the final note, my own last something for this session before I left. Uh, the humanity in the president come out and appreciation of people their contribution to national service. Mm -hmm. You see his touch, he's devastated that people that all left their home like what can say, they left their family for good, they never return with the answer to the call of national service. So you don't say them people that they would they are calling full fake federal. Yeah. Mm -hmm. That was the good. And I shall say, this one I foresee a loud and clear message that their killers will be, will be tracked, will be traced, investigated, and brought to book. Let them pay for that. This is a law, a country of law and order, not a violent country of um, insurrectionists and domestic terrorists. We will not accept that. I tell you plenty. Thank you. Thank you, uh, Minister of Information, Mohamed Raman Swahe. I will come over to you. Uh, former presidential spokesperson and press secretary, now press secretary for Larry Save Gill. Last word and talk to Fabule. Well, I think um, the presidents don't say everything which people expect to say. They could say, one, as a father of the nation, because obviously um, when you get Papa Naos, you know, um, he gets Bende Naos, and um, when I say, as a start, now he say, he say they address the country with a heavy heart. With a heavy heart. Because, like, uh, initially, say, when then police personnel and they would have left those, you know, some of them will get family members. Some of them will get picking them. Some of them, if not man, then some say married, you know, if not woman, some say left a man, you know. So, the families, they will not left. You know, their lives will forever be changed. Imagine if now your brother now be that policeman when you watch the video when you see even though the man die and they kill him back and they kill him back and 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 you know they, 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 they take tick and they walk up from your brother that one day you see him that one day that image it goes stand you for the rest of your life Indeed. for the rest of your life so that is a serious serious thing 
It's a heartwarming thing for that family. But at the same time, the speech also ensures say, that the president don't assure people, say, everybody for be calm. Everybody for be calm. Because there is peace and order, and go and show say that the peace will enjoy. Nobody, like Rolado say, no group of people no inflict terror on this country. And when you realize and see, say, even on the day where people are going to chant, say, oh, madam, you forgot that they go on and say, what can I state out? Really it was a direct attack on the seats of power for overthrow the president. Yeah. Very clearly, that's reasonable. Like, and mm -hmm. crime dandy, mm -hmm. that it's reasonable. Mm -hmm. So it means say they want the way incite, they want the way sponsor, they want the way collaborate. We will get this kind of fatal consequences will lead to murder, mm -hmm. attempted treason, and all that. And they then for be held accountable and face the full force of the law. But there's another issue as well. Because people and they say, oh, we we'll let dialogue with all sides, the man can at the table. Well, then the question we ask yourself, who are those sides? Who are those sides? Who are those sides? Who are those sides? Because who must have been there? Because before the, 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 the protest starts, mm. the police them say, can clearly say, nobody not going to police for request for permission as a group or as a leader, say they won't go out. Yeah. So it was a first place demonstration. So then you go to the with People will not sabi. So these are just a bunch of people away. They are insurrectionists, they are insurgents, they are people away. I think they all had only one purpose. Mm -hmm. For make sure say then create anarchy in this country, for create chaos in this country, for disturb the lives of ordinary people. Away. And this collectively as a country, we all for team up for support the president. For more we'll make sure say that all the one they were responsible for bring them to justice and for make sure say we continue we will continue for the excelling peace and for make sure say we move with development of this country for good before and as operation political parties this also an opportunity for them for make them safe make them identify people who are in party when are they being them protest there when they sponsor and they collect, make them hand it over to the police. Yeah. So this also is a responsibility for the debt. So the APC themselves, this is the opportunity they have. Make themselves among themselves and they people away, they know say, and then be the collaborate, and then be the sponsor and finance. Then people they are going to street for go create this chaos for when they hand it over to police. Because Boko of them, there are many intelligence around. Especially in the Eastern part of Italy, mm -hmm. of the meetings they were all the side of the whole, the meetings where they have with them, many, many days. Mm -hmm. So they said get responsibility now for calling people they out and hand over to the police. Yeah. Okay, so finally, 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 you know, so the speech, uh, how do you, in one sentence, this speech, not be for assure uh, the general Sierra Union public. And for one the one and we need warning. Hmm? Mm -hmm. That this is not a country of law and order. Any bush shaking, the law will take in fullest course. And like can say, na a civic duty, na a civic responsibility. We always talk about rights. But rights about responsibilities. If you know your neighbor, if you know anybody will play a role in this um, domestic terrorism, in this insurrection. A civic obligation for discussion of the police for further actions. Thank you, thank you. I'll tell you plenty. Thank you, Minister of Information Mohammed Rahman Swahiri and the press secretary, uh, and the office of the president, Kate Thomas Sandy. Family will now listen to this program, will now watch and listen to this program for turn. Thank you. I also want to follow on and no say anybody will say to go talk to the police. Lorna feel assured that the police not will disclose an identity. Lord, I feel assured, say, the police will treat you now in confidence because when police they take information and follow leads, they don't need to disclose any theory for do the source of the information and intelligence. And they will treat you now with respect and in confidence, but then also follow up on that information they will now give them for less salon continue for be safe and better. And I don't hear you from His Excellency the President. Say, so don't watch with bad guy with it happen. The law go for dump and people them where they find wanting like a butter stone and one for a short silence 
that therefore continue to be stiff, peaceful, and feel calm. And that him as president of the Republic of Sierra Leone, commander in chief of the armed forces, no retire for a responsibility and constitutional mandate for keep we safe, in peace, and now we're able for get the freedom we deserve as Sierra Leoneans. Till next time, Mina Imran Sila from the Strategic Communications Unit, when I'm in the moderator, we join Keke Thomas Sandy, Press Secretary, and the Minister of Information for get this program. Till next time, I say, ta-ta. <laughs>